for freshman infielder Dean Curley. Just how nice did it feel to get out there? I'm, I'm sure you're pretty frustrated not having to deal with the injury and not be available opening weekend, but how nice was it to get out there this weekend? Uh, it, was a good, it was a good feeling. I mean, injuries happen. You just got to persevere through it. And just it's great to be in the lineup and be able to get out there. Tony kind of talked about the vibes and mindset from the team being different today, yesterday. Just how would you compare the two? Um, it was just there was a fire lit where it was more run it up on him, don't take it light, and just kind of win the game. Tony mentioned that Christian Moore has kind of grown into a leadership role in that middle infield. What was his message to you today going into this game, and how has he kind of given a leader to you? Uh, I mean, he's always been a leader. Um, the whole year, he's been a great guy to look up to. He's been there, um, super easy to talk to, and just a good guy to be able to get, hear from with his good experience. So just told me to relax, and just it's another game. With everything from you know being away from home, really, and, and the workouts here, and the, the caliber of the players and everything, what's this level of ball been like for compared to what you thought it would be? Uh, I mean, it's everything I thought it would be. It's the best of the best. Um, day in, day out, everyone's here trying to take a spot. Um, it's great competition. So it's just a good environment to be in. What would you say the strengths of your game are? Um, ability to learn. I mean, a little change being out here, different weather, different play style, different people. So just kind of adapting and getting better every day. I know you've been working your way back, but when you were silent there for a couple of days uh, through the week, kind of what were you doing to try to stay as fresh as you could? I'm um, just staying with my routine. Doing the basics, not getting too, doing too much. What was your pitch you got on a homer? Did you think you had it over the fence and you hit it, or were you? Uh, it was a changeup in, and I didn't really see it off the bat. It was the same pitch I grounded out on, so I knew we'd kind of go back to it. So just stayed, stayed under the baseball, and it, the ball took off. How close are uh, you and Ariel, especially kind of going through this learning process and, and bouncing ideas off of each other? Yeah, really good. I mean, we live next door to each other, so we're hanging out. I mean, all day at the field, after the field, so it's good. It's good friendship. How unique is it that baseball can bring a kid from Cali and a kid from Florida together in, in Knoxville, Tennessee? It's really neat. Um, learn a lot about other people and get to know his, his background, meet his parents, meet his family, and become really close with them. So it's really sweet. When you came here, were you focused on you know being as shortstop as possible, or were you just kind of a, like, I'll play anywhere? I just play anywhere, any way to get in the lineup. Anything else for Dean? All right, thank you.